Hey everyone, welcome back to another The Maury's Plays Let's Play of Animal Crossing. Let's go to the city or Animal Crossing City folk. And it's past the summer solstice now, so we're back to a dull and grey and cloudy afternoon at the end of June. I guess. Do you know what? I would rather, if it was going to look like this, I would rather it was going to be raining. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> Uh, okay, so today we're just going to go with the flow. Don't really have too much planned. Um, I've just got a few things to sell that uh, remained from the last episode. So I think we're going to go ahead and get rid of those first. Just so I've got some clear pockets. Um, actually, did we have any mail? I, I think we need to go back and double check if we've got any mail or not. Um, still no silver fishing rod. Why not, Tom Nook? What do we have to do to get a silver fishing rod? Uh, this is a double Pascal item, by the way. Um, uh, so we don't need to worry about that. We've got it uh, stored away with Mary. So we're just selling a double Pascal item. I believe we actually need one more item from Pascal. Um, but we just can't seem to get it. Right. We've got empty pockets. Let's go and check on the progress for our money trees. I just did a trade with Sunny. Um, Cara Lee, who made the flag, um, she kindly gave us the Earth Day item, which is the cool globe, I believe, and an extra shirt for our number collection. Um, and since I was doing the trade um, and I was online, I went to the other town to get some more money. The spare Wii. I went to the spare Wii town that we use for testing online features. I went there to empty that bank account. No, I just took some money out um, for the money trees. So again, we're not doing it uh, using the spare money for gain. I just picked another three bell bags um, from that town just to use for aesthetic reasons to try and grow money trees. Since we're not using the money, we're not going to benefit from that. So I think it's okay. Um, but that's all you've missed. Really? Nothing... Um, Nothing's happened outside of those. Moment of truth! Oh no! Why won't these trees grow? What do we do now? Our plans! No! <laughs> we had such big plans! Maybe, maybe it's just too close together. Should we try just putting one here instead and then here? It would still kind of be a circle, I guess. Um, okay, let's let's try. It seems we're playing with um, someone else's money. We may as well try. If this doesn't grow, there's something suspicious about this area. Um, oops, I used the wrong, <laughs> wrong shovel again. Maybe that's why. I keep using the wrong shovel first. Uh, let's put it in this one, just in case that is to do with something. Maybe we contaminated the floor accidentally by using the silver shovel. There we go. Um, if these don't grow, I guess we'll just have to put up with just having four. I mean, at least they look nice and they're in a nice kind of area, but why tr other trees aren't growing here? I don't know. <gasps> oh, mate. No, it's, it can't be to do with the number of money trees, can it? Because the tree would still grow, it just wouldn't produce any money. I was thinking maybe you can only have four money trees. Hmm. I need an expert. Is, is there any experts on money trees? Anyway, it is technically Thursday. Um, yeah, it's, actually it's Thursday in real life. We've caught up. Um, so I thought we could head to the city actually and check out Red. We should have some money on us as well, so we may even be able to buy a Gracie item, but I don't know if we will actually be able to. Um, we'll have to see, but we'll definitely go up to the city, I think, and check out Red's items. Maybe we need to do a little bit more saving before we buy another Red item, but let's see who's around town. Maybe we've got a visitor. Um, so yeah, today I'm kind of making up as I go along. Normally I come in with a little bit of a vague plan, but I have no plans today. It's been a strange day. I'm, just, I'm trying to uh, get all this done at the last minute. So I'm not very prepared today, but it's okay. We can wing it. We can pretend we know what we're doing. Um, okay, let's have a little look. Is there anything else that we need to double check? I don't think so. I'm just gonna water the hybrids before I forget. Oh no! Wow, we have to we have to water these every single day, literally. We better check on our 
carnations as well. How are they looking? Okay, we've still got carnations. That's good. I think we'll sort the fossils out today as well. So we'll head up to the city briefly, check out the red items. Maybe there'll be a painting. And then we'll come back and start tidying up the town by uh, cleaning up the fossils. And, and any money we make from that, we can put towards a gracie trip tomorrow. That makes sense. Let's do that. That's a plan. Greeting! Where do you get all that energy from, pal? You look raring to go. Yeah, I'm so unprepared today. I have no energy and I'm unprepared. I, I don't know what you mean, Harry. Uh, hey, Skippy! You heard about the scandal. It's all about Red, that shopkeeper in the city. Seems that a bunch of paintings he sold out tend to be forgeries. Can you believe it? Okay, who's painting these forgeries? Because they must be pretty close to the originals, right? For people to buy them. I guess the lesson here is watch what you buy, even from a reputable seller like Red. I wouldn't even call him that, to be honest. Naturally, I'm too savvy shopper to be worried. I can smell a fake with my eyes closed. Well, good for you. Maybe you should come to the city with us, Harry. Okay, I think we've got uh, plenty of space in our pockets. We should be good. Uh, okay, let's head up to the city. Bus to the city. It just doesn't feel like an afternoon, does it? It feels like... It feels like the middle of the night with this dull grey weather. Hey, Cap'n. Long time no see. One ticket, please. Actually, one return ticket, please. Here we are. Oh, at least it's sunny in the city. There's a tiger on the loose. Is that Rowan? Is Rowan in this game? Used to be an islander in the GameCube version. We'll have to go and see. Oh, no Phineas. That's a shame. It is Rowan. Whoa, it's already two. Uh, I blew way too much time at Gracie Grades. Today's menu, scarf lunch. Do some quick stretches to prevent shoppers cram, then back to shopping. I like your energy. Now that's some energy that Harry would approve. Okay, uh, what are we doing? Yes, we're going to check out Red. Because his stuff refreshes every Wednesday, so we're a day after the new stock. So I hope there's something. I see a painting. It looks like he might always have a painting, you know? Uh, well, if it ain't our favourite cousin, a hearty welcome to you, Maury. Hey, that's right, cousin. You introduced Mary from Moryland to my little shop, right? Don't sound too pleased, Red. <laughs> well, seems that she took quite a liking to old Red and decided to join up. Uh, and I owe it all to you. Here, this is... Oh, this is Red's way of saying thanks. It's a thousand bells just for you. Don't spend it all in one place unless it's here. What? We get money from Red for inviting people? Loophole. We could just keep inviting people. I mean, that's a very long-winded way of earning bells, actually. But uh, I wish I could remember which paintings I bought. But six months of buying random paintings, I'm never going to remember. So we're going to have to buy it, aren't we? Uh, now, if I, uh, if I had my druthers, I'd like to keep it around forever. But if my number one best-selling... Uh, best selling best customer wants it then I guess I can part with it for a mere 3920 bells which now thanks to Red's generosity is 2920 bells because we just made a thousand um, bells awesome uh, please take a look around let old Red know if anything else strikes your fancy well we've seen this before but did I buy it I can't remember I, I feel like I feel like if Red stocks an instrument um I feel like it would be rare, but this is... I'm always too scared not to buy them. I think I'll leave it and check because we are trying to save money. I can check in the guidebook, actually. Um, we've definitely seen this before, but I don't remember seeing that instrument. But I could be wrong. I'll check in the guidebook to see if they're exclusives, and maybe we'll come back. Listen, Rory, do you know anyone else who'd be interested in joining our happy family? I'll even give you a new invitation. Uh, Red, we do not need any more invitations. We've had like a bazillion. These boxes here are a cool item though. I wish we could keep them and put them in our house. Okay, dare we go and see if Gracie Grace is home. Hey, it's the same villagers, except Rowan's gone. That is weird. Okay, we'll have a little peek in Gracie Grace, but I don't think we'll be buying anything because I need to 
double check the prices of things in which we've already bought. I would hate to buy something we've already bought. Uh, welcome to Gracie Gracie, specializing in wearable hort arty culture uh, from full of, full of home. Okay. Oh, Gracie's here again. Wow, we've been pretty lucky. Is Gracie here all the time if Gracie's furniture is here, maybe? I don't even know how much we have in the bank. Teddy, whoa, this is way too much fanciness for one dude to handle. I like it in here, to be honest. It's very relaxing. Gives you something to work towards. Um, I'll just double check how much the carpet is, though. Gracie carpet is the same one uh, on display in the store right now. Like all of our pieces, this one is carefully handcrafted by our artist. Who are your artists? Have you got a workshop behind the shop somewhere? How much is it? Oh, 124,000, never mind. Oh yes, of course, I, I completely understand. How awkward is that response? That's such a, yes, you are not rich enough to be in this shop. Um, well, thank you, Label, for making us feel terrible. By the way, I've been hearing gossip about you. Sigh, you don't look well. Oh, I'm sorry, you know how I get. Lately, things just haven't been going so well. Yeah, Tom Nook is spilling all the tea about you, by the way. Here's a, here's a real gossip. And I just started wondering, what am I doing working here anyway? Hey, you're doing a great job, and you look awesome in that Gracie scarf. Don't let anyone else tell you otherwise. See, I had a big fight with my sisters a while ago, and I ended up leaving home. The fight was so bad that I can't even pop in from time to time to see how they are. I'm sure you can. Oh, I wish they would just make up. This is the saddest storyline ever. Whenever I go through hard times now, I always remember my little sister's face. She was so young. Oh dear, I'm so, so sorry for a prattling on like that. If my boss caught me, I'd never hear the end of it. I'm so sorry. I hope you'll understand, but I really need to get back to work. Okay, um, I understand, um, label, but your secret's safe. I'll tell your sisters that you say hi and that you hope they're okay. Thank you for stopping by. No problem, we'll be back tomorrow. That is the plan, as long as we make lots of money from the fossils. Um, okay, nothing much else to do up here. It's a shame the auction house isn't really a thing. If only we could gather like three people together and we could all visit at once and I could, I could put an auction up. Is there anyone else that can visit Wheeze in 2023? I think Cara Lee, Sully would be up for it. Uh, anyone else want to do it? We'll, we'll try and do something maybe in a couple of weeks so we have time to prepare and I can try and do an auction or I can host an auction. That would be so cool. I'd have to check the details though because I'm not really sure I'm not really sure how it works, but anyway, that's pretty much all we can do in the city. Um, other than go to a show or something, but it's a bit early for that. Actually, I wanted to check how much we have in our bank. I, th I think it's over a hundred thousand actually. Um let's just deposit. Oh, 130,000. Okay, let's deposit another 10. 114, nice. So we could we could buy a Gracie item, but do you know what? We'll save that for tomorrow. We don't want to get too much stuff done today. Sydney, is that you? Hey, getting to know all the villagers. Uh, this is the best time of day to be in the city. Lots of hustle, lots of bustle, sunshine. It certainly is. Okay, we're gonna have to wake Cap'n up again. I wonder what he does in between journeys. There's like a buzzer on this signpost that says, Cap'n, we're ready. I, I want to use my return ticket, please. Yes, yeah, so I'll just sit in the same seat as always. Back home, please. <laughs> And we're safe home. Ah, oh, Harry is waiting for us. Should have come to the city. You could have grabbed a bargain from Red. <laughs> okay, so let's see. I think we might have to drop our tools somewhere. Because we've got a lot of fossils to pick up. So I think I'm just going to drop our tools here. Oh, this invite card. I wish Red didn't give it to us. Where I better keep the slingshot on us. You just know. You just know the time we don't, Gulliver will come flying past. Okay, I'm going to dispose of this. Ah, they run over the flowers. I'm going to dispose of this invitation. Because you can't even use it as like a normal letter because 
if you send it to another villager, we learnt this, if you send it to another villager, they just see it as an invitation rather than a letter. Um, okay, hey Pelly, bye Pelly. So yeah, we'll just put it in the recycling, may as well. And then we'll check this and we can get back to our fossil sorting, which I've been putting off for way too long. Uh, just in, we received a rare piece of baby panda in our showroom. Ooh. I can't remember if we had a baby panda. Right, might as well start from this side. Oh, I hear a balloon! <laughs> super, super good hearing lately. But if only it was Gulliver. Where is it? There it is. You have to wait patiently for it to come over the cliff. Twice we've accidentally, well once we did it on purpose to see if it would work, but the second time we did it accidentally it landed on the cliff. There we go. And it's a red clock. Interesting. I wonder if the Mario items become less common if you've completed the set. This should also help our, uh, with our evaluation because apparently we have too many things laying around so that should really help especially when we get rid of the trees we need to do that this week as well I put that off from last week because we kept having things happen um, so we'll definitely get around to that it makes me laugh and smile actually about how much there is to do in this game you log on thinking oh what are we gonna do today and actually there's always a bunch of things to do especially if we're trying to actively like design little areas anyway Right, let's try this painting first. I don't know if we've already donated one. It's easy just to buy it from red and then try and donate it. Oh no, it's already been donated. And if my memory serves, my uh, little dear Owlet, very patronizing, it was uh, Maury who donated it. Wait, so is this a real painting then? So do, does this just automatically become a real painting or could it be a forgery that's interesting because now we don't know if this is real or not maybe they only decide at the point of donating so if we donated that into another museum maybe we'd find out then but it sounded like it was like oh you've already donated this painting so how do you have two it sounds like it was real okay the first fossil is not required. I'm just gonna go through and this might take a little bit of time so I apologize. It's my fault for leaving so many out. Um, it's pretty dialogue heavy. But I, most likely I think we only need like five or six fossils something like that. A really small number in the grand scheme of things so I, we probably won't find one that we need to donate anyway. And this is a Plessio Torso. I really wish there was an incentive in this game to complete fossils outside of the museum. Like in New Leaf, if you've donated the entire T-Rex for example, you can collect it again and get Cyrus to customize it into a little model T-Rex. Um, and it's just another way of, of kind of making use of the fossils. Oh, this, uh, the, I wasn't paying attention. The Styro, uh, Styro, Styrocosaurus appeared in the late days of the dinosaurs. We just completed one, yes. So we did donate one at least, so that's something. Its characteristic horns and collar look like frills. Very dino fashionable. What? what? <laughs> and actually they had to be because the rear frill was used by males to attract females. I guess fe male female relations haven't changed much in all these years. Um, I beg your pardon, I was so enthralled. I sprouted hot air like a boiling teapot. No problem Blathers, we've got a bunch to get through so let's go. So one out of four so, so far isn't bad, especially since there's not many that we actually need. <laughs> and I definitely already donated that. The smaller fossils are pretty cool though. Like the one tiled fossils. Um, there we go. I can't imagine any more of these are gonna be 
donatable. But the good news is we'll sell them all to Nook. And get lots of money so we can buy something from Gracie tomorrow. I don't know what Gracie will think of our Pikmin fashion choice though. I can't remember what outfit we used to do a fashion check last time. What was it? I'm trying to remember, was it, uh, I think it was the Gracie outfit actually, wasn't it? Okay, five more fossils to go. Uh, Anklo Torso. Yep, already been donated. I'd be interested to double check actually how many fossils we do still need. We'll do it. We'll go in there. And we won't spend too long in there. We'll just nip in there and double check and do a bit of a count up. I, maybe it's as low as like three now. We haven't checked in a while. A mammoth torso. Another cool fossil. It's a shame we don't have bigger houses because it would be cool to put some of the fossils or one or two of them in the house. But they just take up so much space. We struggle as it is. We also need to order some furniture from Tom Nook today so we can get some furniture items down in our basement at last. Okay, what are we, two more to go? Uh, identified fossil! Please do, Blathers. You have my permanent permission. You do not have to ask every single time. Patchy skull. And what's the last one? What's it gonna be? An Anglo tail. So how many fossils was that? That was everything that we had on us, Blathers, unfortunately. So it was... Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 fossils. Um, so out of 12 fossils, we donated one. That's pretty bad ratio, but it's understandable because we don't even need many. We need one here. What's that? A stego skull. Fossils are cool. We'll, maybe we'll spend some more time in here another day and enjoy it. Two. Need a neck. Three. I think these are complete. It might just be three now. Wow. I mean, we're so far away from completing the bugs. Those are all there. Oh no, I think we need a body here, torso. So we only need four fossils. We'll have another look. Maybe we'll do a museum tour where we just spend the entire episode inside the museum. Um, but yeah, I do wonder if some fossils can only be got from other towns. I always thought that was a thing, like some fossils are rarer in other towns than certain towns like sometimes you always find t-rex stuff in other times you all always find stego stuff i don't know if that's true but that's always what it felt like right let's go and make some money we're gonna go and sell these to nook we're gonna have to come back and get our stuff later uh, we'll sell these and then we're gonna order some exotic furniture ready for our basement we're going for now we're going with exotic furniture and cabana furniture <laughs> Okay, let's see. We're just going to sell everything. We don't even need the, the painting. Might as well sell it. Woo! Easy money. Although we've been sitting on it forever, so. Let's go and double check what this bear thing looks like. I don't know. We do ha we have bought a panda. But did we buy the baby one? That's so sweet. Lovely dresser. Oh, Cabana Light, how perfect! Cabana Lamp, sorry. We'll definitely buy that. Okay, do you know what? We're gonna buy the bear. I feel like... 
is rare. And it's cheap, 456 bells, we'll take it. That will look sweet, actually, in our cabana room. Right, maybe we've got to get lucky and have a cabana wallpaper. Kitchen wall. Why is there always a kitchen wall? Every every time I feel like it's a kitchen wall. A robo wall. Have we got the robo wall? Hmm, might have to check that. Modern wall. No, I was hoping for cabana or exotic wall so we don't have to order it. Slate flooring. No, thank you. Uh, stone tile. And uh, pastel dot rug. No, so we're going to have to check the robo wall because we are collecting the robo stuff as well. Uh, let's see, robo wall probably have. Yeah, robo wall, there it is. Okay then, let's get to, we might as well start. Do we want the exotic bed downstairs? It does take up a lot of space, doesn't it? Hmm. Got the bureau, which is really cute. It only takes up like, one tile in this game. Uh, okay, we're gonna leave the bed for now. We'll see how much space we've got. Um, and if we need to, we can buy the, we can buy the bed. I think we could only order three things, if I'm correct. So, oh, bench, that's a weird item as well. Uh, we'll skip the bench. We're gonna go for a chair. Um, or is it five items that we can order? End table we definitely need. Um, we'll just try. Uh, I think five might be the limit. There must be a limit. Otherwise, you just fill your mailbox, unless they just kind of get queued. Screen is a must. Oh, we can. So that's, what's that, four items now? Is there anything else I can do for you? Yes, catalog, please. Um, screen, chest. There's a big item. Oh, it's the last exotic item we've got. Oh, there must be quite a few exotic items we need then. Um... Okay, let's try and order just one more cabana item, if we can. That way, the cabana light, or lamp, won't look too out of place. Let's swap, uh, armchair would be good, I think. Whoa, we can, that's six items, what is the limit? Maybe ten's the limit. I think we'll leave it there though, we don't want to get too much. Um... Okay, we'll go and put our cabana lamp in our house, I think, just to kind of wrap up this chaotic, random episode. At least we kind of formulated somewhat of a plan for the next few days. Um, sometimes I just, yeah, you just kind of do what needs doing, I guess. <laughs> right, let's head home. Gaston, we haven't talked to you in a while, actually. Probably should say hello, shouldn't we? Oh, afternoon. Where'd you get all that energy from, pal? And we got a lot of the same types of villages in our town, I think. They all say the same stuff. It's obvious what's going on. One of them must have some dirt on the other. Wait, who are we talking about here? And why are you gossiping in the first place, Gaston? Didn't take you for a gossip. Yep, no mail. I just traded with um, Carly, as I mentioned earlier. And I thought we've sent each other a letter online, but they don't seem to be coming through for some reason. So I don't know if that feature doesn't work but it's a bit strange okay so we've got a cabana light there we go we've got hey it's lit, uh, lit up the room pretty well actually and we have a little panda which is kind of cute so i think what we'll do is we'll just drop it in here until we know how much space we're working with actually look, it feels really big in here is this room this room is definitely bigger than the upstairs, isn't it? Is it? I don't know, it feels... Yeah, I think it is. So we've got, in that case, the exotic and the cabana sets are good sets to work with because they're quite large sets. So uh, we, need a, we need a big room. Uh, but there we go, we're gonna wrap it up there. Just a quick episode, just get a couple things done and just kind of go with the flow. And at least we know we've got some money tomorrow from the fossils. We cleared those fossils up. 
we will get around to the trees as well and then we'll get another island evaluation at some point this week and see how we are doing for trees um but i do wonder why they're not growing i wonder if dropped items on the floor has an effect on that hmm but there we go we'll do some more tests and that over the next few days i hope you enjoyed it let me know if there's an item you'd like to see in the house specifically or if there's a certain layout you'd like i'd love your input as well i want this to be our kind of town our house so please let me know your input i would love to read it and i'll get back to you later a couple of hours after the video has been up and yeah thank you so much of course the channel members for making this all possible could not do it without you um, your your support is just incredible and i can't thank you enough and i'll see you all tomorrow bye